Hello future doctors, I welcome you all to this wonderful platform of CAT and Aspirants. So hello everyone, as of now there are 20 all Indian Institute of Medical Sciences in India which are functional. Functional means the academic activities in those medical colleges has been started. But but but, I should mention one thing, that in AIMS Madurai, although the academic activities has been started, but the construction works are yet to be completed. Okay, if you look closely, they are currently operating their academic activities from a temporary campus at Government Medical College Ramanathapuram and hopefully in coming one or two years it will be fully functional. And besides that you may be heard about that there is a news that AIMS Avantipura in Jammu and Kashmir could get possibly established by the year 2025. Okay, But let me clear you one thing, National Medical Commission has not made any official confirmation till now. Okay, So let's see what happens in 2025. Okay, So in this particular video first we will discuss about the category wise final cutoff rank and cutoff marks of all 20 aims in NEET UG 2024 counseling. Institute wise one by one we will discuss about all 20 aims. Okay, So what I have done now, I have arranged all 20 aims in descending order of their NEET UG 2024 cutoffs. Okay, And at the end of this discussion we will analyze how many marks a student need to score in NEET UG 2025 to secure an MBBS seat in any aims excluding aims Madurai. So let's get started. Okay, So first we will discuss about aims Delhi. See, in this particular medical college, after completion of MCC round 1 counselling, there was no vacant seats for round 2 counselling. So all of these candidates got allotment in round 1 counselling. Here I have also mentioned about the cutoff marks, but I will not repeat it verbally, otherwise unnecessarily division of this video will get long. Okay, look, here I have mentioned about allotment round. What does it mean by the allotment round? It means considering all 4 rounds of counselling, that is round 1, round 2, round 3 and stray vacancy round counselling. In which round of counselling, the candidate with least mark got allotment in this particular medical college for that respective category. Okay, So for unreserved category candidates in AIMS Delhi, the final cutoff rank is 47. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 186. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 214. For SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 647. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1150. Okay. Next, we will discuss about AIMS Jodhpur. Okay. In AIMS Jodhpur, for unreserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 374. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 695. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 805. For SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 4912. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 10281. Next, we will discuss about AIMS Bhopal. In AIMS Bhopal, for undeserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 510. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1135 and this candidate got allotment in round 3 counselling. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1013. For SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 12,010 and this candidate got allotment in round 3 counselling. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 15,645. Next, we will discuss about AIMS Bhubaneswar. In AIMS Bhubaneswar, for undeserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 665 and this candidate got allotment in round 3 counselling. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1278. This candidate got allotment in round 2 counselling. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1940. For SC category candidate, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 7879. And for SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 24290. This candidate got allotment in round 2 counselling. Okay. Next, we will discuss about AIMS Rishikesh. Okay. See, in AIMS Rishikesh, for undeserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 731. Okay, this candidate got allotment in round 1 counselling. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1139. This candidate got allotment in round 2 counselling. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1200. And for SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 8393. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 19156. Okay, next we will discuss about AIMS Nagpur. In case of AIMS Nagpur, although this medical college is relatively newly established medical college, but you will see the cutoffs are very high in this medical college. Okay, so for undeserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 953, and this candidate got allotment in round 3 counseling. Okay, for OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1801. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1824. For SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 10774. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 23240. And this candidate got allotment in round 2 counseling. 
Okay, next we will discuss about AIMS Raipur. In case of AIMS Raipur, you will see for unreserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India Rank 1180. And for OBC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 5074. This candidate got allotment in straight on counselling. That is why this candidate with such a higher rank got allotment in this medical college. Because you all are aware of that, all the candidates who got allotment in round 1 or in round 2 or in round 3 counselling, if they got an allotment, whether they join their allotted college or not, it doesn't matter. If they get an college allotment in any of those round 1, round 2 or round 3 counselling, they are not eligible to participate in straight vacancy round counselling. That is why sometimes you will see a candidate with lower marks gets a good medical college in straight vacancy round counselling. Okay. For EWS category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India Rank 2371. For SC category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India Rank 13250. For SC category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India Rank 29829. Okay. Next, we'll discuss about AIMS Patna. Okay, in this particular medical college, you will see for unreserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1476. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 2004. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India Rank 2927. For SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India Rank 19,736 and all of these candidates got allotment in round 3 counselling. But in case of ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 42,342 and this candidate got allotment in round 2 counselling. Next, we will discuss about AIMS Bhatinda. Okay, it is located in Punjab. Okay, so in AIMS Bhatinda, for unreserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 1,609. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 2,729. This candidate got allotment in round 3 counselling. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 3,603. For AC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 16,961. For ST category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India Rank 40,833. This candidate got allotment in round 1 counseling. Okay. Next, we will discuss about AIMS Mangalagiri. This medical college is located at the state of Andhra Pradesh. Okay. So for unreserved category candidates, the final cut of rank is 1,930. This candidate got allotment in round 3 counseling. For OBC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 3,575. For EWS category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India Rank 3,329. For SC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 23,947. For ST category candidates, the final cut of rank is 41,495. Okay. So next we will discuss about AIMS Bilaspur. In AIMS Bilaspur, the cutoff for undeserved category candidates, I mean the final cutoff for undeserved category candidates is 2,410 and this candidate got allotment in round 1 counselling. For OBC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 3,386. For EWS category candidates, the final cut of rank is 4,135. For AC category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India Rank 23,569. For ST category candidates, the final cut of rank is 44,528. So next, we will discuss about AIMS Colony. In AIMS Colony, for undeserved category candidates, the final cut of rank is 2,435. And for OBC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 3,445. For EWS category candidates, the final cut of rank is 4033. For AC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 20,728. For ST category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India rank 56,211. Okay, next we will discuss about AIMS Gorakhpur. In AIMS Gorakhpur, for undeserved category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India rank 2448. This candidate got allotment in round 3 counseling. For OBC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 2749. This candidate got allotment in round 3 counseling. For EWS category candidates, the final cut of rank is 3254. And for SC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 22,145. And for SD category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India rank 47,073. Next, we will discuss about AIMS Bibinagar. I beg your pardon, this medical college is located at Telangana state, the state of Telangana. Okay, so now in this particular medical college, we will see. The final cutoff for undeserved category candidates is 2588. All India rank 2588. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 4020. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 4496. For SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 23710. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 40,731. Okay, next we will discuss about AIMS rivalry. Now, in case of AIMS rivalry, for undeserved category candidates, the final cut of rank is All India rank 2,994. For OBC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 3,549. For EWS category candidates, the final cut of rank is 4,216. For SC category candidates, the final cut of rank is 
28,489. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 53,282. Okay, and this candidate got allotment in round three counseling. Okay, so next we will discuss about Ames Guwahati. Okay, this is located in the state of Assam. Okay, for under the category candidates, the cutoff rank is all India rank. 3,784 and this candidate got allotment in round 3 counselling. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is all India rank 4,746. Okay, so for EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 7,484 and this candidate got allotment in three vacancy round counselling. For AC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is all India rank 30,968. For AST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 99,762 and this candidate got allotment in three vacancy round counselling. Okay, next we will discuss about AIMS Jambu. Okay, now in this particular medical college, the cutoff for undeserved category candidates, I mean the final cutoff for undeserved category candidates is 3,787. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is all India rank 4,718. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is all India rank 5,307. For AC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is all India rank 31,135. For ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 46,129. Okay, next we will discuss about AIMS Rajkot. Okay, in this particular medical college, we will see for undeserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 5,455 and this candidate got an opinion, stray vacancy on counseling. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 3,121. Okay, for EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 3,824. For SC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 27,209 and for ST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 43,200. 288. Okay, next we will discuss about AIMS Deohar. In this particular medical college, for undeserved category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 7381 and this candidate got allotment in stray vacancy round counseling. For OBC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 4181. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is all India rank 4828. For AC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 34,078. For AST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 61,493. Okay, now for AIMS Madurai. In case of AIMS Madurai, you will see the final cutoff for undeserved category candidates is 18,812. For OBC category candidate, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 19,454. For EWS category candidates, the final cutoff rank is 22,488. Okay, for AC category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 1,5,492. For AST category candidates, the final cutoff rank is All India rank 1,45,910. And all of these candidates got allotment in stray vacancy round counseling. That is why you will see the cutoffs are significantly lower than any other aims. Okay, so I have covered all the 20 aims. Now we'll discuss about the expected cutoff. Okay, now if we exclude aims Madurai, then the final cutoff for undeserved category candidates, considering all the aims, this is the final cutoff for undeserved category candidates. Now, if the difficulty level of the question paper, I mean NITUG 2025 question paper are same as like as NITUG 2024, then the cutoff marks could be somewhat around 685. But if the difficulty level of the question paper raises, then definitely the expected cutoff for of category candidates could be lower than this. Okay, but it also depends upon the performance of the candidates who are appearing for NITUG 2025. But if you want to set a target, then I think it is better to set a target for 685. 685 marks okay so this video got a little bit longer than usual please share your opinion about this video in the comment section and if you enjoyed watching this video please hit the like button subscribe to our channel and share this video with your friends